What's going on guys? Today is game day. When you're in Thailand, this is what you do before a game. Week three. We're going away to a, a pretty cool stadium. We're gonna play Bangkok United Football Club reserve team. They are, Bangkok United is a Premier League team and we're gonna play the reserve team today. They're in our league. It's gonna be fun, 6 p.m., no more sun, night game. Nice stadium. Oh, I'm looking forward to it. Wifey over here is gonna film my game. We got a new camera. It's gonna be good. I hope, you know, no more Facebook Live stuff. But I'm taking matters into my own hand. I'm upgrading my, my system over here because, you know, I kind of just, it's been less than three months that I started. So I'm improving as I go. With some videos, the, the volume's a little low. Just, a, it was a learning process for me these past three months. It's so. I'm looking forward to just, you know, be able to film more, show you guys more about Thailand, more about the daily stuff, more about, you know, weekly trainings and, and what's what happens. เราอยู่กันในแล็บที่สองนะครับของระหว่างทูแบงคอกยูเนเต็ดทีวีพบกับมหาวิทยาลัยปฐุมธานีครับเสียงประชาสัมพันธ์นี้ก็เรียนเช
Here's the stadium. Wow. Welcome to Bangkok, Thailand, a, an amazing football country. We got absolute picture perfect conditions today, amazing stadium, the ground is just immaculate. Um, welcome guys to, the, to my game. This game was a real treat to play. Uh, right here the the first half we had some technical difficulties and we missed a bit of the first half and you know new first time with this camera and 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 you know memory card problems but I'm really happy to to bring this quality to you guys no more Facebook live stuff um, over here we are getting more comfortable on the ball the first 15 minutes we are really chasing a lot running a lot and you know the other team is real confident at home and you know now we start to get on the ball much better fun little fact oh here goes a counter fun little fact about a reserve team um, in our league there's a few of them they're allowed to bring players from the first division down to their down to the the second team to play in actual competition so right here there is three first uh, division players two tie and I believe the foreigner is the striker and that's just crazy oh here we pressure and got a good good shot off um, and then they sub those three guys for other three first first team players so it's quite unique that that's that's possible but that definitely brings the level up the only thing is that this team cannot make it to to Champions League which is the equivalent of playoffs to get promoted the B team the, the second team cannot be promoted it is here to develop the first team players here I get the ball and I lose my balance a little bit and I shot it long but anyways still great great game to play great level 
even though despite they can bring players on and off, as long as those players didn't play in that week with the first team, they can play here. So, so yeah, here we're, this is kind of in the middle of the first half towards the second part and you you know you can see we're we're definitely more comfortable where we're we're getting we're attacking and so are they here ah he actually had him pretty good it was unlucky here this is me on the ball not now the one I just passed um, I, in this first half I really didn't find the ball too much I was I was staying a little too high next to the striker and and my my midfielders couldn't really find me I need to go back and, and get the ball more give rhythm to my team a little bit more um, which in the second half I do in this first half I was a little they couldn't really find me too much and that's not good for the playmaker I need to get the ball all the time so here I'm over here pressing the ball with the yellow shoes and I have to press him, I put him under, I force a turnover and here we start and then he gets caught on the ball and here we're just under pressure, we get it out uh, it was a fun game to play uh, here I take a risk and, and press the goalkeeper I like to run, that was a pretty lucky pass, I don't know if he meant to do that but I like to run, I like to press, I like to, you know, physically push myself and in the first half I felt pretty fatigued because the, the first 15 minutes I think I let my adrenaline get the best of me and I ran a little too much and it's a big field uh, and these, these guys are confident so they're moving the ball well. Uh, but anyways, that first half was, there's nothing really special, it was pretty even, 0-0. Zero, zero. Um, and we definitely didn't play our best game, just towards the end we started playing better. But now this second half, now we, we settled in, the game settles, and we can start really doing what we want, what we can do. Here, this is the beginning of the second half, an absolute blunder from our defender, and just super lucky to get out of there. The, that striker just bottled it for sure. I'm over here pressing, making him uncomfortable, force another turnover. I like to people make uncomfortable. Here, I'm on the ball, I do a little quick connection with my striker. Okay, now we're playing. Here, our captain decides to step up, he hits it bad, but it trickles in, and he's goal! Goal! Check out this celebration, opens up a can of beer and chugs it, you gotta be kidding me. Legendary. I didn't even notice he did that until I saw the picture and there he's like chugging with, a, with one of the teammates. Here I come in, all in, with the tackle, I get a, I get a touch on it, we get, a, we get the ball. Over here, we get the ball. I'm over here, I get the ball here. I turn, shake off that guy. Let's go. Give possession to my team. Now we're playing. Now we're moving. Now, we, now, we, now we're moving the ball. We're comfortable, now we're confident. Over here, uh, we missed the play, but I, I steal it from this guy. I, I, I get it, and I just play a good pass to the left. This guy is our young guy on the team. He did quite well. There's a quota for the Thai players also. Just like there's a foreigner quota, the Thai players, we need to play with two under 21 players and one under 23. And by I mean, we need to start with those conditions two under 21 one under 23 we can take them out right away over here we're just laying it all in the line I'm over here I win this header you know we're up a goal so we're just laying it all we see we're even tripping ourselves because we want to tackle them uh, so yeah they we can play with two we have to play with two under 21s one under 23 but they can be taken out immediately here the goal the striker gives it back to me I, I put him under our young guy like 20 years old um, and it kind of sucks for them because sometimes we put them in and literally two minutes later one of them takes out 
if the coach is not comfortable or confident or the game is too big, the requirement is to start then. After that, you can take the two, the two young guys out right away if you want. So in this game, literally, first minute, one guy comes out. This play was just, oh, I have a nice little heel pass to the Korean. He puts a, a just cherry ball, and we just we just missed that header. That's a goal. I'm over here. We're working hard. We're we're cramping. Everyone, a lot of people already. One guy sub. And here comes the play where I just saved it off the line. And we keep moving off the line. We still keep our lead. And one guy goes down. Ah, my calves, I start to feel them again. And one guy down here on the right. <laughs> oh my god. Over here, I stole it from the sky and I was just alone and I tried to beat him. But my, my, my calves are acting up. Oh, nope. I have to stop. <laughs> So we really worked hard. Here I am trying to tackle again. Cramping at the same time. This guy goes down. So we just ran a lot this game. We're, you know, the, the field is big and these guys know how to move the ball. They're comfortable. So we, we did a lot of running. And um, it was a very physical game for us. It was hard fought. Uh, I believe we missed the goal for them. Oh, this guy takes me out. We missed the goal, so it was like 1-1. One, one. Over here, I ambitious effort with a one touch of the clearance. And here we're just laying it all on the line all the time. Here's, this is me right here, now we're playing. This is our center back, finding himself in not center back territory. Good ball. Here a striker gets a quick shot, blocked. So yeah, it was it was an interesting game. It's a lot of learning for the team and for me. Here I'm trying to play quick. We're pushing. It's the last couple minutes of the game. Catch him under sleep. Right here, he did the job. Cross the ball, son. Go on, lad. He tries to take him. He's a speedy guy. That's why. But sometimes you should just cross the ball. This is like we're in injury time here. Um, and yeah, hard fought for sure. We the first half we ran too much, fatigued. Me personally also, I need to stay in the middle more and settle the game, get rhythm for my team. Then, then start sprinting like a madman. But yeah, it was a lot of fun. We're here pushing and we're pushing here towards the end, trying to get a winner. We're away from home. I'm over here, press, press hard, tackle, tackle. He did well there and then you know we're just we're not gonna lose this game and here it is 90 minutes plus seven one one a lot of injury time because we a lot of cramping in our team and you know staying down wasting time you know how it goes um but yeah away from home three games into the season a win and two ties two games away from home we haven't lost you know, we're still getting to know each other, so looking forward to, to the season. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for more. Peace.